I began fly fishing probably when I started college was when I really dove into it. I moved out to Montana and got really involved. One of my roommate, he was from Georgia, and he grew up fly fishing, and he always took me out. Fly fishing, it's like my outlet to get out in nature and just relax. I find a joy in just being able to be outdoors and the fact I get to be outside in my hometown and can go out and fly fish specifically, which is really my passion. It is tough to get to the places I want to fish a lot. I'm pretty clumsy, so I do fall in a good bit, but that's just part of it. The river is very powerful and you know you're in two feet of water that it can it can mess with you pretty good you step on the wrong rock so it kind of reminds me that hey nature is also really powerful if I do anything cool I'll bring it over here <laughs> I really think it's more of an art form than I'm going out there to fish and catch something. You're kind of going out there and you have to make a good cast, not once, but hundreds of times to maybe catch one fish. I like dry fly fishing more than anything else just because there's something to be said about the idea that I'm watching this thing land. I'm watching it float down the stream and trying to keep it as natural looking as possible and then for a fish to come up and just suck that fly down and then you're on. Oh, it's just beautiful to see. It's a nice one. It's a nice one. Fly the whole day, it's just getting shredded apart. But it's still catching fish. As soon as I have that fish in my hand or my net, and then he's back in the water swimming free and healthy again, that's the most rewarding part because I've got to share that experience with the fish and hopefully grows big and we get to go catch him again the next year. He's so pretty though. Obviously you always want the big fish, but it's really cool to see that I'm able to trick a little four inch fish into hitting this fly that barely fits in its mouth. I think there's beauty to that. I like my cheat code, purple haze. <laughs> I don't think that me fishing and catching 100 fish versus me fishing it and catching one fish should make me think, oh, I had a good day versus a bad day. I think for me, it's again, it's that release. It's the drive to be outside and experience things. You just gotta keep casting. <laughs>